Welcome back, Odoers. As I mentioned in the previous video, SEO practices can be difficult to understand. Still, Odoo's website application simplifies these hard to comprehend technical intricacies and makes it easy for anyone to fully optimize their website in numerous ways with just a few clicks. One of the best methods to increase your SEO ranking is by modifying your site's metadata. Having metadata on each of your pages is the best way to get an, a good SEO ranking. For those who may be unaware, metadata is a set of data that describes and gives information about other data, which your website sends to search engines like Google. This offers search engines much needed specificity when indexing and prioritizing your website on search engines. Fortunately, I can quickly and easily modify my website's metadata in just a few seconds thanks to Odoo's incredibly intuitive website application. So let's see how we can properly manage our website's metadata easier than ever before. All right, so here I am where I left off in the last video. Now to modify the metadata of your pages, you're gonna go to the top menu here and you're gonna click on promote and then you're going to select optimize SEO. Now it's uh, smart to use the promote feature because it'll ensure that search engines know which words are relevant by indicating where those words are in your content. So when you select optimize SEO, a pop-up appears requesting a title, description, uh, and some keywords, um, as well as a quality image for social sharing purposes. All of these elements will help enhance your SEO ranking. And keep in mind that Google indexes your website and social networks. So be sure that your uh, social share uh, options are optimized and looking great because that will help with your SEO ranking. Now, what is cool um, is that Odoo makes this feature available on every single page of your website. So you can fully optimize all of your content in just a couple of clicks at any time. There's also a very helpful preview window on the right side of um, this pop-up, which allows you to see exactly how uh, the search result would look in Google, which is pretty cool. Now, for the title, uh, you want something quick, uh, to the point, and complete, and you don't want um, Google to um, truncate your title at all because potential visitors wouldn't be interested in clicking into something they can't read fully. So the shorter the title, the better. And in this case, I want people to know what to expect when they come to this page. So I'll go with something short, like uh, Stealthy Woods amazing products. All right, nice. All right, and we have an incomplete description there, which I'm going to quickly remove. Um, now, for the description, I'm going to want to write a concise summary of what visitors will see if they click on this link. I can also enhance the quality of the description by using keywords. So I'm going to skip ahead and I'm going to look at the keywords first. And I want to make sure that the keywords I add are not only accurate to my company's website, but I also want them to be terms that I believe my customers will be searching for. So I'm going to go ahead and type one now. Let's go ahead and put the uh, handmade. And then I'm going to click on add. Now you'll notice that there's a language option on the right. Um, and these, uh, the languages here will be all of the languages that you have loaded onto your website. Uh, but for now, let's go ahead and stick with English. Now, after you have added the keyword to your list, a bunch of other terms will pop up, and these are suggested related keywords that Odoo has found for you. And then you can decide if you want to add these terms to your list or ignore them and continue to add whatever keywords that you would like. In this case, um, none of these keywords uh, related to handmade really work for Stealthy Wood, so I'm going to go ahead and just manually add a couple more. So let's put in custom. Um, let's also say furniture and unique. Okay, nice. So we've added um, a few more keywords and I'm actually gonna go ahead and choose one of the related keywords, one related to custom. So we have customer service here. So I'm gonna select that because that is something I want my visitors to know about my company. All right, we have excellent customer service. And as you can see, as soon as I clicked it, Odoo will automatically add it to my list of keywords along with its own array of related keywords um, as well. So this is just one of the many SEO shortcuts that Odoo um, offers to make your life just a little bit easier. So I can't complain about that. Um, now that I have my keywords, let's go ahead and see if I can implement them into a brief description. Um, so we're gonna say something like, um, 
learn about our custom furniture. Okay, so I will see, and actually I'm not even gonna say learn about our custom furniture, learn about our custom handmade furniture, got another keyword in there. All right, and then I can see which keywords I have added to the description here. Um, so that's really cool as well. And then of course, I can quickly see exactly uh, what that will look like on the Google search um, by looking at this preview here. Now, admittedly, this description is a bit short and there is even a warning that is telling us that, uh, but we can change this whenever we would like. So for right now, I'm gonna leave it as it is. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on save. All right, cool. These SEO strategies also come in handy when you have your e-commerce set up and want to optimize each of your products on your eShop. Proper SEO uh, on these product pages will make your items that much easier to find on search engines, which will lead to more sales. And users can optimize their product pages in the same way they would with anything else on their website, thanks to Odoo's easy to use SEO tools. So it's really a quick, efficient and user-friendly. Now, there are also some SEO options to check out on the settings page of the website application. Uh, so features like Google Analytics, console Google search, and there's even a way to upload a sitemap to Google as well. Uh, but those are just a few of the extra features Odoo offers to its users um, to help, help them get the most out of their beautiful website. So coincidentally, when trying to improve your SEO ranking, there are even times when it's best to strategically um, hide less popular, non-informative uh, pages on your site from being indexed by Google. So let me show you how to do that with um, a less popular page, like uh, the Contact Us page, for example. All right, so I'm just gonna jump over to that page. Um, and so, once I'm here, I'm going to go to pages actually from the top menu, and then I'm going to click on page properties. I'm going to head on over to the publish tab and we see indexed here. I'm simply going to deactivate that and then click on save. It's that easy. Now this tells Google not to show people this page in searches. And this is good because you don't want customers discovering your site on Google through this fairly boring link as uh, it would take them to the page that doesn't really have useful information. Well, it, it's useful if they want to contact you, but it's not necessarily engaging content. Um, so when they realize there's not much to see, they'll instantly head back to Google and they will continue their search and they might end up on another site, which is something we definitely want to avoid. And that would ultimately hurt your entire site's SEO ranking because Google would see that people are visiting your site and instantly leaving. And that doesn't make your site seem valuable in the eyes of the search engine. So you want to avoid that uh, sort of scenario at all costs and removing the um, indexing from Google on pages like this is a great way to ensure your SEO ranking stays strong and intact. So for now, I'm going to keep adding some content to enhance Stealthy Woods SEO ranking and hopefully boost my sales. So that's all for this video. Thank you for watching. And if I don't see you, good afternoon, good evening, and good night.